good morning good afternoon good evening depending on the time you're watching this video my name is Gossi Africa for those watching me for the first time kindly subscribe yeah and always make sure that the notification bell is on yeah, so that whenever I'm posting a new video you'll be the first person to get notified so we are in Mombasa Island we are we are showcasing Africa from yeah my goal is always to showcase Africa to the world yeah so I just woke up I need to take my breakfast then uh, after taking my breakfast I should take you to Fort Jesus Fort Jesus if you are good in uh, history you want to learn about Fort Jesus where the Portuguese um, established their base uh, during the colonial period but Portuguese were more into missionary missionary work we have the Arab who are more into business trade yeah Africans at that time they used to practice butter trade then we have the British who are the colonial government the colonial leaders yeah so I'm supposed to take you there show what exists in Fort Jesus you know you can't wait to see this I've never been here it's my first time here but I did not research that you're going to enjoy going to like whatever you're going to find there then from there I'll be going to Mamangina Mamangina beach front yeah an area whereby whenever you're standing there you're able to see all the ship passing the ferry you're able to interact with all kinds of people in Mombasa then from there from there we headed to Mombasa Hotel whereby we have uh, majority of the dwellers there are the Indian community then from uh, Mombasa Hotel we headed to Kongoni River yes Kongoni River is in Diani uh, south coast of Kunda Thank you. Okay. So I need to wash my hands. I just washed my hands, so I want to show you what I'll be served. <laughs> it's a little way, it's okay. It's okay. Let me see. Wow. So, we have Kongoni River and Kongoni Mosque. A mosque in a very deserted place. Yeah. Then uh, yesterday I managed to go to the jungle snake park where I was playing with the pythons. So whoever has not watched the video can you go back and watch the video. As I play with the python. I know some people will be like, why is this guy playing with snakes? Did you just visit our witch doctor? <laughs> Yeah, you do it just uh, befriend a snake so that you may get famous. The questions are many, I know, and I'm ready to answer them. So let them come. We answer them as they come. We're ready for them. These guys have some good tea. I can prove it. It's a good one. It's a good one. It's a good one.
So I'm not a fan of tea. I take coffee most of the times. But as a kid, I used to wake up and eat instead of taking tea, take, instead of taking the usual breakfast. So I just wake up and eat a, a heavy meal. If not, so I just drink. Yeah, I'm giving him fuck. If not, so I just uh, drink milk and we call it a day so i grew up in a home in a home whereby we had cattle this dark cattle so milk was in plenty <laughs> and that oh, this is sweet potato so now the big fight is I have to make sure that I work hard and be able to provide for my family the way my my parents did. So my parents could afford that life, living in a gated estate. Yeah, the way they are big house. Yeah, we could get whatever we wanted. If we wanted that milk, we had it. We, we went to good schools. Basically, we had all, we had everything that a parent could wish to provide to, to their kid. So I need to work hard, and that's why I have to wake up every day and uh, go to work or work every day and do this filming. <clears throat> I like him. I like him. But then, thank you so much to the Black Jew. Yeah, the community, Black Jew is a community um, which we have always worked together, supporting each other, motivating each other. Yeah, give me the, me the ideas that uh, go to Africa, you don't, you don't need to stay in Nairobi, you need to start traveling, and that's why I'm this, I mean, this beautiful island. Yeah, thank you so much to Shabi. The executive producer of both Gladio and uh, Gossi Africa. Yeah, to make us believe that the social media platform can work. And with the right energy, you can always push your um, content the level you wish. Yeah. The difference between me and those who started before me, maybe the biggest YouTuber we have in Africa, is time. They started before me. They just started. And uh, they go again. Bye. So keep on subscribing and share the link with your friends. But it's something about the coastal people, most of them are Muslims, and um, mm -hmm. that's fiber. Uh, most of them are, the most, are from the Muslim community, and um, they prefer eating with their hands. So I don't take this an offense when someone doesn't uh, provide a fork. For you, it's for you. So they use, they, you, they eat using their hands. They're comfortable with it. But in the African way of life, who are brought up eating using our hands, yeah, just um, cut your cocoa, your ugali, with the vegetables you're eating with, or the meat, yeah, and you are comfortable with it. You're good with it. So the, the Western culture, that's what we go to learn in the city, yeah, you know, we 
we came to Nairobi when um, we came to Nairobi when uh, everything we only knew about the ways of the village. We never knew about how to behave in the city. Yeah, and so unfortunate that we left our culture and adopted quite a different culture, quite a different way of life. Like that, until you have some, some, it's a salad. A cabbage, cabbage, carrots, yeah. with plenty of onions. So, the height and now we take it we call it mamri so this is my look today below is have my signature here so never meet me in the streets of Mombasa, don't fail to, do, to to say hi. So if you recognize me, just shout my name. If you are ready, you you you, you can come for an hug. Don't hug me. <laughs> it's a joke. But if you can, we meet. Don't don't be afraid of saying hi. So we have a pool here. Then some water dropping from that side. Yesterday we enjoy some grammar music. Who is a grammar? Leave a comment. Have you ever um, had this an experience of the Mijikenda culture? So we were deep in the village, in the southern coast. That is Kuala Thangi. I would say they are good people. I like them. And I won't mind going back there. Some guy was like, Oh, Tosh, you need to get a girlfriend from the Grigama community. <laughs> <laughs> well. We need to hurry up, finish up, because we may go to a different activity. Sausage. It's raining. I don't like it. Just said it raining. Sorry, I don't like it when it's raining and uh, multi out. Yeah, it's working. That means I won't be moving from this place until it's done. That's punishment. I had a very long program which I should have achieved by the end of the day. I booked my my train 
so I'm supposed to travel I'm supposed to be at the station train station at 10 p.m. so early in the morning I'll be in Nairobi Let me turn the video here, then uh, I finish up with my program. We shall catch up later on the streets, of course. So, my name is Ghost the Africa, and whoever has not subscribed to my channel can go ahead and subscribe. Goodbye.